With regards to our website, I think about what the customer wants. I'm all about keep it simple. Do I want to have something that represents us? Yes, and I feel like I've got a nice, clean website. We provide photos in our menu. And it actually is where we put a lot of our newsletters on. It's where we put a lot of our special events on the webpage. We can update flavors and you know write general notes. There's these online websites you can build now through companies like Wix and Square. Getting traffic to our website, which is very important to us. We are in the process of learning how to do call-in orders or online orders. You can order lunches online, and I do get a fair amount of lunches online. In terms of online presence, aside from our specific website, um, Google Maps, getting on Google Maps is huge. We do a lot more with Facebook and social media. We've got a guy who works up front with us, and it's funny because he's quite salty with the back of the house staff. Customers love him, though. He's mentioned in Yelp reviews. You know, and to me, that's the most important thing is, hey, Customers come in and this guy leaves a mark on them to the point that they get home, they go online and they mention him again. So obviously they've, they've really had an experience with that individual. Another thing when you search for us or frozen dessert, our Yelp page is one of the first ones to come up. Uh, again, Yelp is huge to driving traffic to any restaurant or dessert type place. We really rely on the word of mouth. One of the things you really want to do as an owner is manicure your Yelp reviews. I respond to every single review, good and bad. The good ones we say thanks for coming in, hope to see you soon, and I give my email address. Whether it's responding to Yelp reviews or if they leave a Google Plus review, responding to that, letting them know you saw it and that you appreciate it. Um, any type of Facebook engagement, definitely responding to them, liking their comment, replying, um, it is really huge. It makes the customer feel like they're speaking to you one-on-one. -on -one. Take advantage of these resources that are out there, outsource to other places and keep your costs low because at the end of the day, it's all about making money.